Hello everybody, my name is Dave Conroy and I cycle in Fingal, North County Dublin. I gained my half century in life this year and have vowed myself to keep moving and to keep active for the next 50 at least. I'm not your typical cyclist, at just under 7 feet tall and not very aerodynamic, my way of saying I might be carrying a few extra pounds. I am a member of Sword Cycling Club and join club spins once or twice a week when I feel the need to punish myself for eating too many muffins. But at heart, I just enjoy getting out, meeting others, and in doing so, clearing the head at the same time. My favorite type of cycling is when I'm away on holidays, but not quite the training camps my fellow club mates subscribe to. More the using the bicycle to leisurely travel between one cafe and the next. New places, people, food and drink, and all without maps. I just love losing myself in it all. As a leader, I was often concerned with larger groups and not everybody being able to keep up with those at the front. But in recent times, as a solo cyclist, I've returned to what I first liked about cycling, adopting a more leisurely pace, taking the time to stop and smell the roses, or in my case, to take a selfie. Cheese. So that's what I'm going to concentrate on when group rides return, taking it and making it easy for everyone to join in. I'm lucky to have a great variety of routes, all within a few kilometers of home. When I'm not enjoying my other hobby, canoeing and kayaking, you'll often find me cycling near the sea or the rivers, gazing longingly at the water. The roads around my home are for the most part nice and quiet and very popular with cyclists. I always meet someone I know and I wave to every other cyclist when we cross paths. I'm lucky in that if I don't bring my own flask, I have several options to stop at for a caffeine and sugar hit. I have no firm favourites, but I do look for a spot with all the requirements. Good food and drink, somewhere safe to secure the bike, and comfortable, but not too cosy, or you might have problems getting people going again. I didn't join and become an AXA community bike ride leader to inspire others. It was a much more selfish mission on my part. I originally signed up as a regular Joe. I work odd hours and I've worked away from home for many years. I just wanted to meet new people, have fun, and it's much easier to do that with others who share a common interest. When I couldn't find any local rides to suit me, I took up Cycling Ireland's offer of free ride leader training. Initially, I felt the most underqualified on the course. Other participants ran cycling clubs, had numerous qualifications, competitions, and training under their belts. I'd never led anyone anywhere other than up the garden path. But what linked us all and qualified me and can do for you was simply having a common interest and the enthusiasm to get out on our bikes and to share that with others. I can't wait for group rides to return, to catch up with some of my regulars with whom I've kept in touch by text and making sure they've been getting out on solo rides during lockdown. I've also enjoyed connecting with other AXA community bike ride leaders and I look forward to joining them on their local spins at some stage too. What a great way to explore new routes with local knowledge and all facilitated by Cycling Ireland and AXA Community Bike Rides. Hopefully I'll see you on one soon.